Well, I think I got the camera working now. But I've got my one-eyed hammer, and I can feel. Ah! Okay. Well, we'll get back to uh, what we were doing. Okay, I got the vise in the work head, and I've got this little gizmo here. It's, uh, this has been around for a, a long time. It's a one inch insert vise. And I, I guess they call them that you can grind inserts in them. You could even stick a triangular insert in there. Uh, it's got little step jaws built in. I, I hope you can see that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to slide a carbide blank in there. See? I'll get it. I'll, I'll tighten it up. I'll get it pretty center there. Ah, pretty snug. That's pretty snug. Put it there. A little hammer here. Give a little tap. Okay, now I'm going to put it in this vise. Like this. Snug it in good. Make sure all this stuff's pretty snug. Little lock here. Okay, that's looking pretty good. Now, um, to prepare the machine, you want to run it, you want to, you know, of course, lubricate it, but you want to run this uh, Y axis back and forth a few times to kind of uh, get it lubricated good so you can reduce the stick slip. Okay. So I'm going to uh, run her back. Now I just uh, roughly set the, <clears throat> a little surface gauge up with the uh, work there. And, you know, I got it roughly set up to uh, center the wheel. I'm going to get that out of the way. Now, the... This wheel is, uh, I, I got the number, and uh, it, it's a three and three quarter inch. Uh, they don't say anymore, but it's a lower concentration wheel. And uh, <clears throat> another guy got me onto this. If you want to grind uh, carbide count fast. So I'm going to set the wheel head. At about a half a degree. Uh, a degree, half degree, three quarter degree. No, no, no. <laughs> Almost. There it is. Okay, snug that. Okay, now I'm gonna have to uh, back this up quite a ways. I'm going to rotate this. <clears throat> and I'm going to set it to the scale here because I just want to go across it and take that surface off of it. I'm going to set it at 90 degrees. Doesn't have to be super critical for what it's doing. Okay, got that snug. You want to be sure everything's snug. Not good if it's not. Okay, get this out of the way. Okay, snug, snug, snug. Okay, I'm going to move this over here. Oh, got to take it out of gear. Push it on over. Now, what I got here is a wheel dressing stick that came with that wheel. And this wheel is 100 grit, 60% uh, concentration. And they grind cooler than 100%. 
Uh, the wheel cost $160 from MFC. I got the number and the whole deal for you. Okay, I'm going to crank this on. Okay, I'm just going to run this um, across the wheel. It will open it up a little bit. I don't know if you can see it kind of wide and open it a little bit. Now, I'm just going to break this outside edge just a little bit. That'll keep it from chipping because I'm going to semi hog on this thing. Okay, that's good. And now, you get to ride the exclusive carriage cam. Okay, ah. gotta squeeze around here. <laughs> okay, now remember, I said for this job anyway, you gotta load it from the front over here and uh, you have to come back here you can't see the work here see okay let me get you hooked up let's see how's that go something like that there we go i got to open this all the way you see the wheel head there. Let me see if I get that. I know it's doing it totally wrong. Of course. Okay, now that's snugged in pretty good. Let's get that over there a bit. <laughs> of course, I left it in gear, I think. Damn. Gotta make sure I have everything tight. Oh. Let's see where we are. Let me move it back. I don't want to plunk into it. The machine is probably going to. I might have to turn a few something. Maybe like that. Let's we'll see how that works. See if I got the jail stone. Yeah, that, that's looking pretty good. Okay. Let's, let's find this real quick. And touch it off. Now I got a mask on back here, because this stuff's toxic. And some ventilation. Bear with me. Getting fluffy. Well, <laughs> I stalled it. Didn't want to do that. Okay, we'll do it again. It's sort of, uh, the guy that showed me this really hogs this stuff, and there we go, I'm just touching it. There we go. Okay, I'm going to feed it in um, about a thou at a time here. You see that? That's like 2,000 there. Do you see that dust coming off there? You see it shining out?
Okay, I can see you're in another couple down here. You see how easy that is? This is a machine tool. Um, it doesn't have very much power. This one's an old timer. It only has a third horse. Um, the ones in the 50s that are similar to this, um, I think I have a half horse, maybe three quarters. This one's low powered. That's how I stalled it. But I'm kind of glad to see me make mistakes because you're going to make them yourself. No. Okay, see that? Now, there's a trick. You know, this is a coarse wheel. Now I can move this out and I can take a piece of high speed steel and kind of fool this wheel a little bit into being a, a little bit uh, finer. I'll, I'll show you. I'm just going to touch it. And you can feel it just kind of smoothing up through the steel. The steel kind of dulls it. So I'm going to go back and feed it in. E1000. And see if I can get a little bit of a shine on that. 